Hey guys, welcome back to this week's episode of Budget Beauty Buys. I am so excited to take you guys along shopping with me and see what's at the stores. If you are new here, hey, my name is Kim and I go around to the discount stores like TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington, Nordstrom Rack and we look for high end makeup at discounted price points and there is usually new stuff every single week so I take you guys shopping with me. So make sure you guys subscribe because I upload tons of beauty content, shop with me videos, all that fun stuff on my channel. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on my videos you have to subscribe and hit the bell at the same time because YouTube is crazy town these days so I appreciate you guys and all your support so make sure you like this video as well and comment when you do those things it helps out my channel so much so I appreciate it thank you guys and let's get on into these stores and see what we can find this week First, I found these Sephora Amour lashes, and you guys know I've been finding a lot of these Sephora lash sets recently, so these were $8.99. One of my favorite finds this week was the Miss Piggy and Ciate collab. This is a cream blush kit with some really pretty shades, and this was only $9.99. So let me know if you guys found this one. It is such a cute collab. These were new makeup storage. This was actually a rotating beauty case and it had a little uh, pullout drawers and then a place where you could put like skincare and makeup and stuff. And they also had this beauty organizer case too. Those were I think $30. And then they had some stuff on clearance like these Bare Republic sparkling uh, sunscreens. These were $5.50. Kula was also on clearance, such a random number, $10.40. They had a lot of those on clearance. This was a new find, the Sephora Banana Mask. And this was $2.99. They had these Creme Shop Holy Brow kits. And these had three different shades in them, including a wax. And these were only $3.99. The Creme Shop Toasty Cushion Bronzer. This looked so cute. And this was $5.99. More shades of the Holy Brow Eyebrow Kits. They also had light and medium. This Sephora Metallic Palette is also a new find. And I did see this is still on the Sephora website actually for $28. So I was really shocked by that to find this. Um, and it's not even discontinued. And it is only $9.99. It can be highlighters or eyeshadows. And they had the Miss Piggy collection again at this store. I kind of found a lot of the same repeat stuff at each store. And then there's just a look at all the names of the colors. I found this Laura Mercier opening night cheek palette. And this was pretty pricey, $29.99. So I thought that was a little, little much for the Laura Mercier. And then you guys know I found these a few weeks back at Marshall's. So I found all of them. The Sephora I Love Eye Shadow Palettes for $4.99. Some nice BH Cosmetics brushes like this V4 Foundation Brush for $3.99. And then they also had this Blending Crease Brush for $2.99. I found the Real Techniques Blush Crush or Brush Crust. I can't even say it. Brush Crush Brushes for $3.99. They had this tapered foundation brush and a contour brush. These Moda Mythical brushes are so cute. I love the crystal handles. This was only $3.99. And this one was like kind of angled. And I found MAC Powder Kiss Lipsticks. I put some swatches so you guys could see the shades. And these were $7.99. Kula Mineral Sun Silk Moisturizer for $19.99. Mario Badescu Kits. This had the Acne Cleanser, Facial Spray, Aloe Moisturizer. And you guys know these have been popping up a lot over the past couple months. This set was only $12.99. I thought these were cool. They were these Beach Wave uh, sprays, but they actually said they were salt-free. So usually these Beach Wave hairsprays do have like salt in them, but this one was actually a texture mist. Um, so this was $6.99 and you guys the Beauty Blender Foundation is on clearance for only $3. That is an amazing deal. So definitely grab that. These sheet masks were on clearance for $0.70. Cents. I think you could probably find those at Dollar Tree. Um, this crop foundation was only $1. I always see this brand at Marshalls and TJ. This 
makeup eraser pads. These were $3. I love using those. This banana milk body lotion was Yellow Tech clearance for only $2. And that is a K-Beauty product. Satin hydrating pillowcase. This was $4. I love those. This Kerastase dry shampoo foam was only $3. Winky Lux moisturizer. This was $3 yellow tag. This shave and haircut candle was in the clearance section for $3. This was a really pretty brush kit from BH called Opal Illusion. And this was $12.99. And it came with a bag as well. So there's all the brushes that came inside the kit you have a powder brush blush brush buffer brush eight pieces in total i love these headbands i really hope these go on clearance they are so beautiful and i always look at them every time i go they these are 12.99 they have a bunch of colors some more morphe brushes for 5.99 you guys know i've been finding these recently this one was a, a cool shape Zoeva brushes. I have found these in the past. This is the large powder brush for $5.99. And I found this bedhead body hair waver for $19.99. So that is it for this week's episode of Budget Beauty Buys. I am first and foremost so excited that the Yellow Tag stuff is finally out. So usually Yellow Tag is out in July, but it seems like they push it to August this time. And I must say this week I was like super disappointed in the stores. I feel like there really wasn't that much stuff. That's why this episode is probably going to be short because there really was not much it was so disappointing and i traveled far to this one store that i thought was going to be good and there was like nothing so ugh, it's just it's like so frustrating when there's not good stuff yeah it just stinks because i always want to show you guys as much as i can and i just did not find anything that great this week so it's okay um Hopefully you guys found some yellow tag stuff. Let me know in the comments if you did find any, what you purchased. Happy the Beauty Blender Foundation is marked down and that one is one of my favorite products. So let me know what you guys are finding in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!